Welcome to Superhero 101, where the street is your classroom and books are replaced with on-the-job training. <laughs> 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 That's good, because I'm a hands-on kind of guy. Ugh, I'm terrible at quipping. That quip would have worked better if you actually used your hands. Hands, see, nailed it. As if one Spider-Man in this town wasn't annoying enough. You know what they say, two web heads are better than one. You know your jokes are horrible, right? Have you ever stopped a bad guy with comedy? Not yet, but there's a first time for everything. Like you, trying out those new web shooters you built. Great idea. Take this, Scorpion. Okay, the shooters work great. Your aim, not so much. I guess I got a few things to learn. You probably did too when you first started out, right? You mean three months ago? Yeah, I should think so. <laughs> not exactly what you call a veteran. Well, you're a great teacher. And besides, I need a mentor who can spin webs and stick to walls. So. That kind of narrows my options down to you. I'm flattered? Do you two ever stop talking? Copy that. Moving into second position now. Hey! Where does he think he's going? Something's not right here. You getting your spider tingle jangle thing? It's called spider sense! And no! It's just more of a gut thing! Spider gut? Maybe I didn't get that power. What I mean is, Scorpion's more of a gloat about his evil plans type of bad guy, and he hasn't mentioned what he's up to. We were in the middle of a conversation and you ran off? So rude! Joke all you want. My job is done here. Over the years, I've roamed the jungles of the world, stalking the most dangerous creatures of life. Huh? Oh man! Craven's Amazing Hunt is on! It's my favorite show! But today, I've come to the asphalt jungle to hunt something different. Hey! That's us! We're on TV! The most dangerous prey of all. The menace known as... Spider-Man! You might want to pick a new favorite shell. Any last words, Spider-Man? Uh... <laughs> to Spider-Man? Thanks a lot. What? I'm not Spider-Man, I'm a totally different guy. Besides, these reality shows are all fake anyway. Move! Hit! Fake, huh? You really gotta work on that spider sense of yours. I told you not to call me when we're alive. Do you want both of them? <laughs> My pleasure. Tranquilizer darts? Yeah, so maybe he's not trying to kill us on live television. He takes his prey home and does it there. But it's all just a show for the cameras, right? Something tells me this guy's more about the reality, and less about the show. Gwen, look! Spidey's on Craven's amazing hunt! <gasps> so is Miles! What about Miles? Uh, I was just saying, this is Miles' favorite show. Really? I don't know if I approve of these types of shows. I think they just dull your senses. Scorpion must have been a setup. He was just bait. <sighs> yep, and we took it hook, line, and stinger. We're still live on TV. Then we better get out of here and come up with a plan to deal Mr. Reality a reality check. Do not fear, good viewers. Craven the Hunter always gets his target. I can leap with the agility of a jaguar. Swing with the ease of an orangutan. <laughs> and strategize with the cleverness of a human. To which terrain did the prey escape? Uh, huh? Which way did they go? Oh, um, they went that way. Much thanks. Let's head down Fifth Avenue. I find the wind current there increases my swing speed. 
Uh-oh, I forgot. Craven studies his phrase patterns and then sets traps based on their behavior. <clears throat> he totally knows everything we're gonna do! Wait, what? <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> Saying he's booby trapped all of New York City? Yeah. Pretty cool, right? Are you not the least bit concerned that someone is hunting us? Sure, but he has to catch us first. Only a matter of time, young Spider. Preferably 22 minutes, not counting commercials. One thing's for sure, I am never wearing my Craven Fan Club shirt ever again! Every penny. Adrian. What is it? My latest plan to capture the Spider-Men. Since my Slayer wasn't able to retrieve either of these spider specimens, I figured why not hire the world's greatest hunter? Only instead of taking them back to his museum for mounting, he'll deliver them to me for experimentation. And he agreed to this willingly. Craven may be a hunter, but he's also a businessman. And businessmen are always looking for financial backing. Something I was happy to contribute to. Look at them. The urban spider humans in their natural environment. Amazing creatures. But do not worry, loyal viewers. My sonic blasts have taken down rhinos. I don't think a couple of little spiders will be a problem. The good news is, this is some good hero practice for you! Only you can find the bright side of this! Huh? I feel my spider sense, but can't tell what direction it's coming from. Watch out! Huh? Miles! Go! Save your sidekick, Spider-Man. I've already witnessed your analytical mind in action. Show me how compassionate you are to the cluster. A cluster is a group of spiders. Something you earn when you're craving knowledge. Brought to you by the good people in public media. Did he just call me a sidekick? I hate you say that again and I'll blast that mustache into sideburns. I don't know if this will work, but time to try an electro blast on this thing. Yeah. Way to go! Yes. That was amazing! I know! I thought a group of spiders was called a clutter. No! I mean, what you did was amazing! Plus, you might have just figured a way to beat Craven. I did? Yes! He studied my patterns. But you're so new to this whole superhero thing, you don't even have patterns yet. So me being inexperienced is a good thing? Right now it is. So we both need to be unpredictable if we're going to beat Craven. Where's some place we never go? A comedy club. I was thinking the sewer. The sewer? Ugh. Unless that's the name of the comedy club. Follow me! Nope. Nothing funny about being down here. There's no way Craven set any traps below ground, because I never use the sewers. Brilliant. Unless... Unless what? On the show, Craven also tries to predict what backup plan his target might use. Like, say, going underground? <laughs> Whoa! Spidey sense has kicked in! But it's coming from all directions! Because the danger is too! <laughs> The hunt is over! I have won! But we expected that, didn't we? <laughs> no use in struggling, young spider. That cage is made from electrified titanium alloy, three times stronger than steel. And made by Cages Incorporated, available at select hunting outlets. And now, the branding iron. Uh-oh, the branding ceremony. It's the ultimate humiliation before being shipped to his museum. Your knowledge of this show is getting annoying. Sorry. I have defeated many jungle animals, 
But today, I am victor over a new breed of creature. The human spider. Let all who look upon them see that they were brought down by Craven! Hero lesson! If your supervillain turns his back to lab, disengage his cage! Nobody escapes Craven! Oh, nice shot! I'm a quick steady. Then here's a lesson in web crafting. With a little branding of our own. <sighs> oh, what's the matter, Cravey buddy? This episode not sticking to the script? Ciao! Turn those cameras off! No! What is that idiot doing? This was not part of our deal. The Craven show just got canceled. That's okay. Cooking with Carol is my second favorite show. Uh oh. You expect to humiliate me and get away with it? For centuries, my family has been the deadliest of hunters. But now, my rage extends far beyond that. And so you will suffer a slow and painful destruction unsuitable for television! Whoa! I've never seen these darts before, and I've watched all the deep deep bonus materials. Yeah, these are heat-seeking darts. And, uh, whew. Thank goodness for truth and advertising. Head for a heat source! Ice cream, cold cuts, freezing. Oh, come on! No! Snug as a bug in a Moroccan wool rug. But let us make it even more tighter, shall we? That was a venomous fear dart that hit your friend, extracted from the African cobra. It will not only frighten him, but if not treated, scare him to death. The more you struggle, young spider, the faster the venom seeps into your bloodstream. No! Get away! Get away! Where did he go? Where did he go? Not gonna find out, stuck behind a boomerang! <laughs> Where are you? He couldn't just disappear like that. Maybe thermal vision will help. There! <laughs> he must have some sort of camouflage power we didn't know about. I gotcha! Miles, calm down! Calm down! You're a spider! A terrifying spider! I'm not a spider, Miles. I'm... I'm your friend. I'm Peter. P Peter? Is... Is that really you? Yeah. It's me, Miles. I'm Spider-Man. No, he can't be. I'm freaking out! I know, it's a lot. And that venom isn't helping. But just try to calm down so it doesn't spread through your bloodstream so fast. Okay, deep breaths, calming down. Wow, maybe see things, Peter. Yes, but you know what else it did? It unleashed a power you didn't even know you had. Cloaking? I mean, come on. First the electric sting, now invisibility? Man, I wish I was bitten by your spider. What are we gonna do about Craven? We are not going to do anything. You are getting dropped off at a hospital while I go after him. I have to go with you. He's not going to quit until he destroys you. He could be anywhere. Or I'm guessing he's at the Central Park Zoo. Ah! Then let's go. Miles, you have to rest. Hmm. Part of being a hero is knowing when to fight and when to heal. There will be times when you get to work as a team, but there are other times when you have to finish on your own. Sorry! Lunch time's over! What's that? I don't speak lion. Uh, 
but you're welcome! I don't know what I like better, Spider-Man. That you took the bait, or that you have become the bait. Feeding time, my kitties! You couldn't have made an army of penguins, huh? Attack! Here, have a seat! This is seriously the worst petting zoo of all time! This is for your own good! Trust me, I'm not lying! Uh, get it? Lying? Ah, uh, you don't care. Uh, kitty. Nice kitty. Uh-oh. Well, I always wanted to be an amateur lion tamer. Yeah. Wait, don't all cats love balls of yarn? Or webs? What are you growling at me for? I'm an animal lover. <laughs> Craven's the hunter. Why don't you growl at him? Because they recognize the true king of the jungle. Well, that's where spiders and lions differ. Actually, there are a lot of differences, but, but you get my point. As will you. Norman Osborne? You saved me? Saved isn't exactly the word I'd use. Struggle all you want, my spider friend. Those electromagnetic restraints can hold both man and beast. We had a deal, Craven. I bankroll your little TV broadcast in exchange for the spider man But you feared from the plan, and nobody disobeys Norman Osborn. My honor is more important than your money, Osborn. And that spider disgraced me! Well, lucky for you, Spider-Man is not going to enjoy the next few moments. <sighs> it didn't have to be like this, Spider-Man. I asked you to be my friend, but you refused. So now I have to do things the hard way. You are quite an interesting specimen. At first I thought you were an anomaly, a freak in fact. But then came a second Spider-Man and my concerns were confirmed. A spider army is on its way, isn't it? I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, sure you don't. But fortunately, I don't need you to understand. I just need you to be dissected. Don't! Don't do it! I'm a... afraid! Huh? What? You don't understand what happens when I'm afraid. Sometimes I just want to disappear. Where no one can see me! Oh, I get it, I get it. Ugh, your cowardice disgusts me. I'm surprised, Spider-Man. If your blood runs yellow, maybe I don't want it after all. Hmm, actually I do. Oh yeah, practice makes awesome. Ah! <sighs> Whoever you are, be careful. Don't make the same mistake Spider-Man did. Join me, and I promise you won't regret it. No, thanks. Huh? Those are quite the moves. I can't tell if you're a vulture or a funky chicken. How about you jolt first and joke second? Patience, Teach. I just wanted to show you what I can do on my own. I'm incredibly proud. Yeah! I'm just a wee bit jealous! Yeah! You fool! You've ruptured the hydromatic condenser! Get me out of here before this place blows apart! I think we should follow their lead. Hold on! What are you doing? He tried to kill us, remember? Another hero rule to learn. Just because the bad guys try to wipe us out, doesn't mean we do the same. Leave me to perish. 
I have failed and deserve to die. Get over it, Craven. You spent so much time with animals, you've forgotten that part of being human is picking yourself up when you fail. That's reality. Too bad your viewers can't see you do that. And for the record, I'm deleting your show from my DVR. We should get out of here. Where'd he go? There. Yeah. Should we follow him? No, nobody was hurt this time. But if he crosses the line again, we know where to find him. Yeah, Thursday nights on the Mustache Channel. So, that was a pretty terrifying training session, huh? Are you kidding me? I wasn't scared. It was just an act. Really? So that camouflage just randomly kicked in on its own, huh? You know it. Oh no, Craven's back! Ah! I thought so. <laughs> okay, I guess it was a little scary. Which goes to show you, sometimes even your fear can be a strength. I guess you're right. And hey, listen, I want to thank you for showing me the ropes and the webs. You're a good teacher and a great friend. Thanks for trusting me with your secret. Thanks for trusting me with yours. Although remember, at school, nobody can know I'm Spider-Man. As far as you know, Peter Parker is just the incredibly handsome, brilliant kid down the hall. So you want me to lie? <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously.